The official Ark Survival Ascended trailer just dropped and I am so excited because it looks insane! We'll show you the entire 4K trailer uninterrupted and then I'll give you my reactions and break it down piece by piece to show you all of the incredible new features coming to Ark Survival Ascended. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe and let's get started. First of all, just wow. I can't believe how amazing Ark Survival Ascended looks. Like, I have all the feels right now because it is just so stunning and breathtaking seeing Ark on Unreal Engine 5. I expected it to look great, I really did, but this just blows me away. I have seen this exact spot on the island map so many times on Ark Survival Evolved and I don't even recognize it because it looks so good now. So if you don't know this already, Ark Survival Ascended is not just like a port to Unreal Engine 5 from Ark Survival Evolved. They have rebuilt the entire game from the ground up on the most cutting edge, amazing, ultra realistic game engine known to man. The Ark developers basically started working on this as soon as it came out and as soon as the engine existed with the technology to run this game. Ark Survival Evolved is running on an engine that is eight years old, which is like ancient in gaming engines. So we're gonna be losing most of the problems, glitches, just all of the issues that we've had in Ark Survival Evolved. Most of that should be solved on Ark Survival Ascended. Let's be fair, opening week is probably gonna be full of crazy glitches all the time. Just, you know, expect that, laugh at it, they'll fix it, don't worry but the game as a whole is going to run and look like nothing you've ever seen. So let's break down some of the individual features as we see them confirmed in the official Ark Survival Ascended trailer. So one thing they're revamping with Ark Survival Ascended is the pathing system and the AI for creatures. So if you look closely here with this pack of wolves, you'll notice they are actually steering around the rocks and following each other like a pack. And we're gonna see much more intelligent behavior on the creatures. And you're gonna have a lot less times when creatures just jump right off of cliffs or your tame falls to its death for some stupid reason because it's not listening to your whistles, or uh, you just get something stuck and can't get it to move. The AI should actually be helping with that in Ark Survival Ascended, but the other side of it is, 
they might be avoiding traps. We're actually not sure if we're going to be able to use traps on the new dinos in Ark Survival Ascended because the AI might be too smart and they might not go into a trap. And if that's the case, I'll be doing a whole new series of guides on new taming techniques for creatures in Ark Survival Ascended because it could change the game forever. And this clip confirms we are going to have wild baby creatures in Ark. There will be nests for Argies, there's going to be baby dinos all over the place. And if you're skilled enough to survive their parents destroying you, you should be able to kidnap and tame baby creatures that you find in the wild. And that might help to make up for how hard it might be to trap creatures with a new AI. Now you may have noticed that the environment looks incredibly realistic and Unreal Engine 5 has some amazing high-tech features like ray tracing, which actually calculates the rays of light bouncing off of objects so things that glow look like they're really glowing. The shadows are actually affected. The reflections look completely realistic and the shadows of different objects interact with each other and objects in the water create waves and ripples and actually affect the fluid dynamics. And where the island used to feel pretty empty, especially in jungle areas, now Unreal Engine 5 can process so many plants at once, everything feels completely real and it feels like a real jungle. And if you look really carefully at every tree and bush as dinosaurs walk past it, they actually move things out of the way. Individual leaves and tree branches get pushed around and moved and they sway in the wind and when something's hit with a rocket, the trees actually react to the blast. And you can see in this clip where the building's exploding, individual pieces of wood start flying out of every structure when it gets blown up. And speaking of structures, the entire building system is getting a total revamp from the ground up. This is an extremely simple log cabin, but it looks like something straight out of a Bob Ross painting. The building system is being totally revamped, so everything's not only gonna look so much better, but the game will render a base all at once and make things run so much more smoothly even with a tremendous amount of players and creatures and structures all at the same time. We're not sure if this will be available at launch, but Ark is working on a system that will allow blueprints for building structures. So let's say I built something really fun on a stream that turned into a really cool base. I could actually upload a blueprint of that base and then let other people import that into their games and build that base exactly. And it would show you where each piece needs to be placed as you're building the entire structure. It's also great for tribes who aren't necessarily online at the same time. One builder could design their entire base upload the blueprint and then let each person who plays put pieces together and build the base piece by piece exactly as the builder designs it. And the ARC building system in general is supposed to have been overhauled, so rather than spending 20 minutes trying to get the exact right triangle ceiling to snap onto the other one the way you want it to, and it keeps jumping to a totally different spot, not saying that from experience or anything, it should actually work the way you want it to the first time. And they've apparently got the people who built Structures Plus actually working with them to improve the building as much as possible. And speaking of Structures Plus, Ark is going to bring a new mod platform to console so that it's not just gonna be the PC Steam players that are able to use mods like Structures Plus and all of the amazing mods that are brought to the game right now. They're actually already working with mod developers, so as soon as possible, we should be able to play with mods on Xbox Series X and S and PlayStation 5. And I tell you what, if you've never used Structures Plus, you are going to be blown away by how awesome it is. I never used it for years, and now I will never play Ark without it. Oh, and if anybody's wondering, yes, we are definitely getting Ark Survival Ascended for Xbox Series X and S, and PlayStation 5. It's confirmed right here at the end of the trailer, and of course it's coming out for Steam. Now, we're not sure which one's coming out first. I have a feeling it might be Steam first. I just want to set realistic expectations. It's a lot easier for ARK to get a launch out on Steam than it is for the other consoles. There's a lot more processes that have to go through the consoles. But even if you have to wait a little bit for console, it will be coming out and it will be worth it. 
And another big thing to mention is that Ark is going to be cross-platform with official cross-platform servers. I'm sure you'll have servers with just your own console if you want that, but if you've got friends that have Ark on a different system, you can play with them if you find the right server. I'm sure those will be rolling out later after launch, but they are coming and it is officially confirmed. And maybe one of the most exciting things about Ark Survival Ascended is that the Ark devs have confirmed that Ark's journey is not over. They will continue bringing out updates, new structures, new features, new TLC updates, and new creatures for every single map. And they've also confirmed officially there will be at least one more DLC expansion for Ark Survival Ascended. And let's be honest, they'll probably just keep working on it even after Ark 2 has been out for a long time because we all love Ark Survival Evolved and Ark Survival Ascended. And this basically ensures that Ark will just keep on growing and expanding and becoming more amazing as time goes on. Now that it's being reborn on a platform because it was limited by the technology of its time, but now it has shed the bounds of its old coding and become a whole new thing that can keep on growing. There's a whole bunch of new quality of life features that we'll get more information about once Ark Survival Ascended actually releases. And by the way, we haven't talked about the release date. Yeah, it should be very soon. That's the official release date. There is so much speculation, they haven't given us a day yet, but the developers have confirmed they've submitted the build, which means it's mostly finished and should be releasing very soon after everything's verified. The original release date was October, and we're getting close to the end of October. We've only got a few days left, and they have not changed that release date. And this late in the game, I think they would let us know if they were falling behind schedule. So drop a comment and let me know when you think Ark Survival Ascended is going to come out. But my estimate is the very end of the day on October 31st, pretty sure we'll have Ark Survival Ascended to play by then. I will be very surprised if we can play it before then, but we'll see. But make sure you subscribe to this channel and ring that bell for all notifications because I'm going to try to go live the minute Ark Survival Ascended is available on PC, and that way you'll be the first to know about it. So drop a comment, let me know what you think about the new trailer for Ark Survival Ascended. What are your favorite new features coming to Ark Survival Ascended and what are you most excited about? And I also want to say thank you for your patience. I know I have done very little videos this year. I've had so much going on with job transitions and a catastrophic hurricane hit just a couple hours away from my house and my company has been helping to clean that up and provide tons of relief for the victims. And I've been doing very well, just insanely busy, but I plan to come back and do a ton of guides, let's plays, live streams, and everything just as soon as Ark Survival Ascended launches. And another thing I've been busy with has been building a brand new PC running an NVIDIA 4090. And so far with my initial tests, I should be able to live stream Ark Survival Ascended in 4K at really, really high settings. So it's gonna be amazing to see. Don't miss that. And I also just really miss hanging out with you guys. So I'm looking forward to live streaming again and chatting with you all as often as I possibly can. And I'm sure a lot of things are gonna change with the new map on Ark Survival Ascended. So keep an eye out, make sure you're subscribed to this channel, ring that bell for all notifications because I'm gonna be giving you so many guides, tips, and tricks that will save you so much time throughout your adventures on Ark Survival Ascended. And I'll see you all really soon. Thanks for watching this video from the Ark Survival Guide. Please give it a thumbs up, share it around, and leave a comment. That helps us so much, and we love hearing from you. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and ring that bell for all notifications so you don't miss our next video full of tricks that will help you win at Ark. While you wait, here's more videos you can watch right now, and we will see you in the next video.